हेलो स्टूडेंट्स डिस्कवरिंग टट सागा कंटिन्यूस वी हैव डिस्कस्ड दस लेसन लाइन बाय लाइन एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑल इंपॉर्टेंट डिटेल्स फ्रॉम ऑल द पैसेज एंड वी हैव आल्सो कंप्लीटेड इन अर्लियर वीडियो अंडरस्टैंडिंग द टेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन टुडे वी विल डिस्कस talking about the text and this is important thing because you have to think in uh, both the ways the question it is like this discuss the following in group of two pairs each pair in a group taking opposite point of view so now this is the class activity and there are two teams two groups we can form and one group will think uh, in positive manner about the same statement one group will think negative means for the motion against the motion uh, it is very important to uh, know about both the aspects so this type of statements are uh, very important so you have to think in both the way and when uh, we will have a google meet in that also uh, we can have this live discussion because now due to this lockdown we are not getting that feel but still uh, we can uh, discuss such type of questions in uh, live google meet sessions so today just uh, i will give you some important uh, highlights that how can you think with points you can mention how can you think about such type of statements first statement in that scientific intervention is necessary to unearth burial uh, buried mysteries so here scientific intervention so intervention means action taken to improve medical uh, mysteries or the disorder whatever the thing Uh, it is there so action so scientific intervention intervention is necessary to unearth that buried uh, mysteries or such type of uh, things when you are thinking suppose first we will think about the uh, positive aspect of this <coughs> so positive aspect in this concern with the lesson so scientific intervention scientific techniques or the tools are important to know about uh, mr language the uh, how many decades that thing it would be means we can go in the past uh, we can think about uh, what had happened to that so here concern with the mummy if we would take the example anatomy professor he revealed uh, some truths so already it is given then citrus scan machine also uh, had taken the three dimensional virtual body uh, images in different way so that also uh, study was there so you can mention such type of references means when we will have means the archaeological investigations uh, with scientific intervention what will happen here we will try to find out uh, actual reasons why this thing happened what could be the cause so this interventions Uh, scientific interventions actually it is uh, necessary here the part is it necessary so in positive manner we can say it is uh, necessary we have to uh, take the help of scientific tools diagnostic tools uh, to unearth or to understand whatever the things it is it happened in the past and we can uh, go ahead we can go ahead with the 
findings we will get the data and that data uh, we can use and the same thing we cannot uh, repeat it. so like this or we can uh, give suggestions or we can provide such type of research and it will be uh, widely read it will be available to all so again one more uh, important aspect of the same thing in favor of the topic we can raise so what is that in favor of the topic we can raise as per the modern world now modern demands modern world it is developed so just to keep all the things as it is instead of that whatever we have the knowledge if we will implement if we will use that techniques knowledge to get what happened and scientific reasons so it is a necessity because earlier days we we were not aware about the things that we can check that we were not getting the actual proofs actual evidences through that so suppose somebody would say uh, others may not believe but if we will use some scientific tools to analyze that then what will happen that analysis will have the weightage and there will that thing will not be the biased opinion so sometime it happens that somebody is saying so it is correct it is not like this the machine is not biased so whatever the uh, scientific things the scientific uh, research so through that if we will go we will get the data and that would have the accuracy also then uh, we can keep the faith on that uh, type of research again one more important thing through this we can uh, mention that we can have concrete uh, proof and on the basis of that uh, we can put forward the findings and the um, main reasons problems and the outcomes of that so all the things we can discuss so you can mention such type of points you add your own points concern with the scientific intervention is necessary to unearth the rich mysteries then against the topic now for the motion we have discussed now against the motion same question so what do you feel that uh, to unearth the buried mysteries is it really important nowadays we have so many challenges we can work on that challenge instead of wasting the time in doing such type of Uh, scientific interventions to use the technology and all the sources fundings so many things we may utilize and we may not get that uh, satisfaction or we we may not have more advantage if we will include all the things or if we would invest our money time and especially the human resource in that research or findings so instead of that and we may disturb also <laughs> what we can disturb we can disturb all the means communities their faith their belief suppose here if we would take the example of the uh, mummy means the tuts the king tut so somebody may not also be happy with such type of investigation the how the carter did with the mummy and how was the the condition of the mummy if we would observe then suppose you have faith about that person and the condition of the mummy if it is not 
good then you may feel negative you would have that uh, negative approach about such type of intervention scientific interventions or investigations because if that team may not take the care the condition of the mummy or that things the body so many uh, loopholes were there means is such type of things uh, means there is a uh, one term futile means it was not coming into the result so if you are doing it for so many days years also we can mention and if you are not getting anything out of that so it is also the waste of the time if you would use the same time because there are so many things available so many areas are still there that we have to develop so we have to think about the modern challenges new challenges instead of uh, investing the time in past things because that may not help more and we have to think about the present and focus on the future that what we can uh, do more so like that here uh, both the positive and negative aspects you can mention then advanced technology gives us conclusive evidence of past events so advanced technology gives us conclusive here means uh, the accuracy that proves the concrete things advanced technology in that you can mention the x-ray you can uh, mention nowadays uh, the dna testing ct scan machines uh, mri all uh, such type of modern uh, techniques through that um, you can get the concrete proof and that concrete proofs means just to, uh, means previous time what used to happen whatever you will any person may go that person may be good in that understanding analyzing then he will only analyze that and according to his report everyone will believe on that but nowadays we are modern and how can we believe on such type of thing so instead of that if we would have such type of advanced technology which would give us proper uh, concrete proof and that proofs are now it is valid so uh, the forensic lab reports everyone is accepting we means when any death may occur then what could be the cause of that uh, death we are always uh, preferring the post mortem and using that post mortem report uh, we are sending Uh, some samples to the forensic lab and then forensic lab with scientific with advanced uh, technology what they are doing means we can get the time of the death means suppose something would happen then is it an accident or uh, is it the heart failure or something whatever the things happened with that person we can easily uh, guess means why that thing happened so using a uh, such type of uh, techniques mm. we can get the idea or is it the somebody means is that a task a criminal thing may involve means we may have some suspicious things uh, concerned with that so we can uh, understand and what would be the mystery behind that death and the same thing here also mm. in that x-ray Uh, two three important things also concerned with the mummy it was uh, things here it is mentioned means how the scientific things especially the advanced technology help us and what is the question given that advanced technology gives us conclusive evidence of past events and this evidence the proof we require the proof and in court also what is required the proof is required suppose as a research finding 
suppose you wish to do some research then primary evidence primary proof the the primary sample that is here very important and secondary thing it is less important so here when we have a proper tool to analyze proper technology to analyze that same event then uh, we may get the concrete proofs and that proofs will uh, help us uh, in future also and uh, in present also so uh, we can have a positive attitude towards that advanced technology everywhere we can observe that means all the aspects uh, suppose if we will uh, take the example of cyclone what do you feel in ancient time or few years back we may not get that weather report properly but now due to advanced technology we are getting in advance all the things all the data that when that cyclone will come what would be the intensity of the cyclone and then uh, we can plan the disaster management team will work on that then medic calls or messages to all the uh, fishermen everyone we can send we can send all the precautions what precautions you can tell we can give uh, free means toll free numbers that you, we can call we can form the teams uh, like ndrf all they could go in that area for the help in advance and all the precautions we can take so this is one of the best example of the advanced technology here you can in positive uh, you can mention means suppose we have that uh, technological impact then and we have to believe also on that conclusive evidence and concern with the here it is mentioned about the evidence of past event especially about the past so here what happened in the past means how the modern technology help us in present also so here we have to more discuss about the uh, past events the past things why it happened means what was the reason of that then what could be the possibilities of that so all the possibilities that reasons all that things uh, we can get through the advanced technology so now in uh, negative aspect against the motion so what could be the points we can here raise so that point here we can mention concern with this that advanced technology suppose we will refer the uh, lesson the ct scan machine so finally there was no such type of concrete proof using means only the images were there uh, then the visual things we can mention uh, statistical data it is there but there was no concrete reason the proof through that we can see that everything uh, it means the reasons or the what was the cause the till the cause it is as it is we don't know that why it happened what was the cause of the death means when we wish to investigate something with the modern that advanced technology sometime uh, it may not work also sometime that research may be futile means after uh, using uh, human resources then funding of the government then time and uh, sometime we it may happen that we may uh, test to the traditions emotions of the we may hurt we uh, may do such type of task mm, and it may not be applicable to that particular religion also uh, or that particular community society or that country uh, people may not accept also such type of uh, scientific uh, interventions 
or we can you here use the word advanced technology somebody may wish to do that but is it really necessary if we will think it is is it really necessary then the answer will come that it is not actually necessary at this point of time because we have to think about the present always thinking about the past it may not uh, help but if we will use the same advanced technology in concern with the uh, future things or the present uh, lifestyle then we can get more things instead of investigating or in, instead of using that technology money fundings of the government and using the bureaucrats or our all uh, scientists or technicians technical team so here uh, also in the lesson it is mentioned that radiolo means radiologist then anatomy that professor it's uh, the team and then technicians are there so, so many it is means and the, as a leader zai havas he was also there so like that suppose anything concern with the past then if it is concern with the sensitive issue uh, then again uh, there may be protest there may be problem and there uh, the situation of the law and order uh, sometime it may also uh, impact and again if there is no result out, uh, or outcome of that here also same thing happened uh, the carters whatever carter had done there was no any result out of that then after the zahi was when city scan there was also no proper result so sometime uh, we may not get the uh, concrete evidence what why that thing happened uh, so in this case we can say that advanced technology may not give some time conclusive uh, evidences of the past events then question number mm, third traditions rituals and funerary practices must be respected so here uh, why this thing it is given about the tradition rituals so traditions everybody can understand but then what is the rituals means religious or solemn cer ceremony of that particular region a uh, particular religion or a particular area sometime it may be uh, about the whole country so here that rituals the things and funerary practices must be respected so in favor of the topic first we will think so every country suppose we will take the example of india in our constitution the liberty it is given so what is that liberty according to your uh, religion your caste whatever the uh, performing task your traditions rituals or funerary practices there is no restriction in doing that why because you have that liberty suppose you have faith on that then why should we disturb their particular structure of the society and the way suppose they feel happy in that if if it is the uh, tradition then why should we break that tradition if there is no problem with such type of tradition means to worship uh, any god or goddess why should we disturb that so here also uh, there was a faith on the major god a moon but the king uh, changed all things and there was a problem to the uh, community again the young uh, pharaoh he changed that all things and he restored again and he was the angel or the messenger of the um and means he had done the restoration of the old age again old the ways all that things uh, how he had taken care so here the point of discussion we can think that 
tradition, rituals and funerary practices must be respected. So in favor of the topic, if we are thinking, what would be the points? The point, one important point here we can think. It is concerned with the culture of that religion. It is the culture. And when any tradition, ritual or funeral practice, it becomes the culture. And every community has different culture. And so many years, uh, they are following, they are respecting that. And if they are respecting it, why should we destroy that? Why should we interfere in that? You can observe the diversity in different, different uh, religion, culture and their faith on that. And most of the time, if we will observe, they have some uh, reasons also why they are doing that. They have some historical references that why they have started uh, this type of tradition. And who was the founder of that? And why they are doing this? So try to find out that why they are doing instead of opposing that. Then opposite points, traditions, ritual, funerary practices must be respected against the topic. So what points we can raise? So there are some traditions which are not at all good. Suppose uh, we can take the child marriage. What do you feel? Is it the proper way? So we have to oppose because child marriages are not good. Then we can think about the untouchability in some areas, some fam in some families or in some religions or in orthodox society still in some rural areas uh, same it is there means such type of uh, traditions or the wrong things rituals why should we practice if it is not good for the suppose in some uh, families Woman education, it is not preferred. So this is also not actually good. Means, suppose after, means funerary uh, practices in that, suppose there is a death of the husband, then the lady will also go and he will also sacrifice her life. So such type of wrong traditions, uh, and here we have the history that, um, in India also such type of practices were there. Slowly, slowly in modern era, now uh, some practices are um, changed. Still some practices are there. Means after the death, early suppose there is early death, means in after marriage, if there is early death of uh, husband, then very few families, they are allowing uh, that woman to remarriage. So, uh, some orthodox people, uh, they may give her the white sari and all things means uh, she may not go out. So many restrictions are there. So, means funer after, funerary practice. After that, that, that such type of uh, wrong things, if we are uh, still following, in this modern era. So such type of harassment to the um, woman concerned with that or such type of harassment to the uh, some uh, caste people as a untouchability or uh, in some areas still such type of uh, wrong practices are there. So we can uh, think that we should not respect such type of, we should rebel such type of wrong practices and we should follow uh, the current um, constitution or such type of uh, good things 
how the world is changing we have to be scientific we should not follow such type of wrong traditions we have to uh, think whatever it is there good in that earlier system that we can take but whatever it is not good uh, we should not follow that we have to stop that tradition because it is not good for the humanity then next knowledge about the past is useful to complete our knowledge of the world we live in so here in positive manner if we will think then when you are thinking about the past whatever happened in the past suppose first world war second world war uh, then so many research about the past or the contribution of the uh, scientist contribution of the great leaders in their biography or so many uh, different different uh, philosophical books are also there in that whatever the knowledge we are getting through all that it is really useful because we are thinking positive about that and whatever the wrong thing they have done and what to be done what not to be done so we can scrutinize and that scrutiny that findings that understanding of the past will help us to plan that how can we plan in present also in future also that this thing may happen suppose uh, cyclone then in next way next time in disaster management what can we plan we can plan uh, that in that area uh, no such type of civilization should be there construction of the house or uh, we can give them uh, concrete houses but it should be away from the uh, area means flood affected area so many things are there whatever in the past it would happen and there would be so many problems to that area specific area then we can change the plan uh, we can do the research on that so here uh, the whatever things happened in the past that experiences suppose somebody would have uh, mentioned in their uh, books or earlier um, research things suppose columbus reference we can uh, take so many those who have done the great task their references or in space also whatever the space missions earlier space missions uh, recently now uh, the mars mission or chandrayaan also uh, so many things means now how the india it is uh, trying to develop in advanced technologies and space missions so we are always facing problem but the earlier whatever uh, the things we have done and what was the flaw in that we can come out from that flaw and uh, we have to think in positive way about this so here knowledge about the past is useful to complete our knowledge of the world we live in so it is uh, really uh, important so opposite now the knowledge about the past is not useful so in that here we have to think why it is not uh, useful to complete our knowledge of the world we live in so here now we are in the uh, modern era in modern era new challenges are there suppose any religious leader announced something so many years back that time the condition of that community understanding of the community education awareness whatever it was the sources available that time that this person might have taken the decision why should we follow the same knowledge why should we think again the same way 
because now the situation is changed the scenario is changed and we have to think as per the present time we should not rely upon the past means they have done this so now we will change no always the past things may not help in in some cases it may work but in most of the cases present condition is important suppose if we will take the example of uh, this covid 19 pandemic this thing it isn't happened such type of things isn't happened before like this widespread previous some cases are there but this time the world is facing such type of uh, problem first time and we are focusing on more restriction social distancing all there are some references uh, earlier also nowadays you can uh, read in newspaper or in the electronic media that they are also providing earlier references about such type of uh, pandemic but this it is new for us we can take references from past but that references are not useful now because this is a new and whenever something new will come we have to fight with the new things with the new uh, inventions new things because we have to research on that so present uh, condition present conditions are different present problems are different uh, today's challenges are different the world we live our requirements are different our priorities are different so we have to think about the, our own means the priorities the how the world is changing the technology is changing Uh, or so many things now in this lockdown means how the classroom things also changed means in gurukul system it was different now how it is different means everyone you are at home and still you are learning so many things the distance mode of learning uh, then here using this youtube media some they are using google meet so many different different sources are there using that sources online teaching still the education it is not stop because we have such type of uh, modern techniques modern eras so we may not think only about the past that they have done like this so we will also have such type of system and we will uh, not think about the new things so here knowledge about the past is useful we are thinking about not useful so here why the same system is not useful now because the reason is the world is changing and according to the challenges we have to follow the new system new things we can take some important things good things from that system but we cannot rely upon the whole system we cannot run the as it is the same system from the uh, earlier time because whatever the system they set it was the demand of that time and now the demand the priorities all uh, things it is changed so try to think in that manner and the knowledge about the past is not useful to complete our knowledge of the world which we live in so this will prove when we are thinking uh, against the topic understood so we have to think uh, in positive manner also we have to think in negative manner also because the demand of the question it is discuss the following in groups of two uh, pairs each pair in a group Uh, talking about the point of view so here uh, what kind of point of view it is mentioned here opposite point of view so one will be positive one will be negative in this manner now you have you are alone at home so think in positive and negative both the aspects uh, you can think write down both the answers 
and when we will have a discussion that time uh, you can raise your points and there will be very good discussion we will have a google meet on all that four uh, questions so jot down all the points very sincerely uh, think about all four questions and i feel that most of the important things concern with this i have given some highlights uh, you can use your own points your own guidelines uh, and you can have a good gist of the points uh, try to mention maximum points you can uh, think you can ask you can have a, a discussion okay you can take help of the all sources and make the list of the positive points make the list of the negative points and uh, make the good effort to prove uh, for the motion or against the motion so all talking about the text uh, we have discussed thank you